Good morning, Nagaland. I just sent up with Hamble TV. Laga no to next episode. I'm here with exciting guest actor, actor Joanne Guna. So, today DJ or music producer. So, kun sa 2018 the Nagaland Music Awards the best producer laga title we pay na so. Ami ang bisyo manuwa tayo already jani na sa tuluy through this conversation, ajula conversation ba hope crazy kaya aro ami ang bisyo tayo aro bisyo jani mo guna. So let's not wait any longer and let's welcome our guest, special guest, Liden Longchari. So hello. Hi. Thank you so much for joining me. So first, welcome to Sanapay Tumbul TV. So ang bisyo kaya sa. Ah, very cool. Yeah. <laughs> How are so, you? Um, good. Thank you so much for asking. So, uh, first, I do show the start going now. Uh, viewers, can you first introduce who you Okay. So, like, uh, my name is Liden, mm -hmm. and then I go by the tag as DJ Little Bomb, uh, as my stage name, and I'm an EDM DJ and a producer, and currently signed to Infinity Inc. Record label. Okay. So. Uh, Ano yung DJ kita sa and then you are a music producer too, but then mo na nga manon do like we all know DJing and stuff, but then ito laga pass na jen na DJ laga kiki tadi kinga kinga sa so ang first viewers kanya lo familiarize ko do kaya abni laga kam de kiki involved sa or ito system do kinga kam great lao po the first viewers kanya ko do okay like giving good times to the people. And to the crowd, to the audience, you know, sometimes uh, people just want to go out there and have fun during, especially during weekends, they want to go to uh, some parties and uh, just like throw out all their stress mm -hmm. and everything. So whenever there's a DJ and then like they are like just uh, giving you the vibe, mm -hmm. you know, to relax and dance and whatever. Mm -hmm. So. <laughs> So yeah. it's all about relaxing and yeah. having fun or living in the moment in like right, that. Right, so, right, right, yeah. so you do uh, do chulay na, do system, do 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 Firstly, like I had a friend in uh, back in Kohima, so that time I was like really interested in DJing. So I, like uh, I was just um, learning from him. Mm. So and then I started doing small gigs in Kohima, and then slowly, slowly, like um, it was just a DJ controller. Mm. And then slowly, I had to uh, learn the bigger controllers as well, mm. so that uh, you become. Uh, more professional and okay. then if you get to know uh, if you get to learn uh, sorry if you get to know how to play even from the bigger controllers then you'll uh, even get uh, invited to uh, like other cities okay. and stuff okay. so okay. it's like more professional mm. so uh, that the bigger control uh, the bigger CDJs uh, like uh, I two classes from DJ Ina okay. from Infinity Inc. Cha, cha. So, yeah. So ita do apni Infinity Inc. lander desi na. Right, cha. right. So uh, apni do bishu jagadi ita or do a bishu jagadi perform gwe nai she Hornbill Festival and then Nudge Coast Fest kan do we perform gwe nai she and then yeah. outside of Nagaland do you bishu performance uh, perform gwe nai she na? Just around North East. Okay. Yeah, yeah around North East. Yeah. Okay. So uh, apni la first uh, performance la experience la kui do a king a thangin she. My first stage? Yes. My uh, okay back in I started from 2015. Mm -hmm. So back in 2015, uh, actually, uh, my first stage was uh, we were performing in duo. My friend was the DJ, okay, and then sure. I was the hub, uh, hype man. Sorry. Mm -hmm. um, so like uh, I was trying to like um, uh, how do I put this? Um, doing as an MC, you know, mm -hmm. like just interacting with the crowd, uh, so having fun with the crowd, so making them more, uh, you know, Josh. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, yeah, so that was my first stage. Mm -hmm. And then like um, by the next year, I um, started, uh, um, I learned 
how to play the controllers mm -hmm. and then by the uh, next year that is like 2016 my first gig i did was in kohima and then that was my first paid gig oh, my f that was my first like official my uh, only DJing gig so i got 1000 okay. from my first gig okay. and that that was like the uh, very awesome moment mm -hmm. still very the memories are still very clear <laughs> with me so <laughs> yeah so, uh, Omni, uh, you know you are one of the most renowned DJ in Nagaland, and then Omni, music best music, music producer like award pay say in, yeah. uh, you know, twenty eighteen. Twenty eighteen. Yeah, in twenty eighteen. <coughs> so, you know, uh, ingan uh, experience, ingan achievement, recognition, ingan pay nasa do where you expecting? Uh, actually, it was very surprising for me like uh, 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 see regarding this uh, best producer thing mm -hmm. actually uh, I contested for this uh, EDM music and then the l there was like uh, good pr uh, producers and DJs mm. on the uh, EDM section okay. so um, me and my ex-manager and even my uh, some of my friends came from Kolkata that night so we were just uh, sitting there inside this um, Nagaland Music Awards. Mm -hmm. It was in it was held in Kisama that year. Okay. So we were just waiting for our uh, EDM section. And then uh, when the winner was announced, uh, it wasn't me. So like, <laughs> we were uh, like quite unhappy. But then, oh, come on, it, uh, this is my first time. Nah? And mm -hmm. then there's like many more years to come. And then we can just keep on trying mm -hmm. and then we were just sitting like and then suddenly uh, there came the like best producer section and then unexpectedly that my song won th like the best producer thing so like that was the most exciting thing ever right. and uh, how has thing changed since then um, my turning mm, actually s um, my turning point was 2017. Okay. okay. I was uh, invited to play in this uh, Hornbill International Music Festival. Mm -hmm. I opened for DJ Ina and Terry Miko. Mm -hmm. It was like a dream come true. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that was my turning point. And then from then on, after 2017, I was like uh, getting invites from like Assam, Manipur. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, and different states in Ireland. So, uh, 2014 year uh, Amni insp inspired you Krishna through a music festival Tomorrowland. Yeah, back in yeah 2013-14. Yeah. Yes, oh. yes. So after right after the 20, uh, 2014 2015 which the Amni performance can do late start with See uh, regarding this um, my uh, music thing, mm -hmm. <coughs> inspiration. I can talk a lot about inspiration. Sure. So inspiration, actually, the first thing, uh, inspiration came through my dad. Okay. When I was a very young kid. Music there. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. When I was a... Uh, <laughs> not in DJ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in, in not in DJ, in music, yeah. yeah. When I was a very uh, young kid, uh, my dad, uh, I consider him as my rock star, okay? Mm -hmm. He used to sing all those uh, Kishore Kumar stuffs, mm -hmm. you know, so... And then uh, during his college days, uh, he studied in science college. Achha. So when I was a, a very young kid, uh, he was invited to science college to sing as an alumni. Mm. So like I saw him uh, performing on the TV live. And that was in uh, Daudasin Kohima channel. So from there, like I was thinking to myself like, oh, one day even me, I'm going to like be standing up on the stage just like him. So that's that was my like inspiration for music. I never knew that I would become a DJ. Hmm. So <coughs> and then uh, then I slowly started to play uh, play the guitars and then the drums and like all the different instruments. Like even though I was not that good, but I was just trying to play each and every instrument. So hmm. yeah, and then slowly yeah. <laughs> now you're here. Yeah, okay. uh, inspiration like. It's the people that really inspires us, mm -hmm. you know, uh, for the DJing, and then for the production is mostly like just like one of my favorite producers, Avicii. 
Achha. He said like uh, melodies uh, really inspire him, mm. and that that thing like really hit me hard, because like mm, back uh, back in 2014 when I was uh, studying and watching about all these music festivals and stuff, like uh, melodies really inspired me to produce mm. music. Mm. Uh, so yeah, that's you how know, it all started. You uh, know, DJing is cool. It's actually unconventional choice, it does. Not considering the yeah. like thin scope. Yeah, right, right, right. So you know you always want to do be a musician, but then I mean, kita DJing kulit you squishy. I mean, you were were you serious? Ki that DJing it full time crew ko na. Right, that was like uh, I since that time, mm -hmm. like since that point, uh, especially after 2017, uh, I thought to myself that oh man, uh, I just want to do this. And I, uh, I, I really have the passion for this, so I'm just gonna stick to this no matter what. Take a simon idla conversation or continue kuna jao. Tuli ta kadek ta break lina. Tuli wapa sa wala sa dagi wisa na pito mbil TV. The best institutions teach the most, and not just teach a lot. NICSE believes in not just cracking one exam in life but in an education that can also equip for the exam of life. Every day is a feather added. Every day is a day conquered at NICSC. Be in the team of goal achievers, in the company of best learners, an environment for daily steps, daily efforts, daily learning and testing, daily corrections, daily molding, and daily succeeding for the ultimate success in exam. Crack the NPC exam with NICSC. Coach with the best. Welcome back to Napoli Tombil TV. Today, Idia Amian, Amian, like just little bomb lode. Question run game kilo lese. Get to know little long cherry better edition. So. I mean, what, uh, which one do you prefer, Little Long Cherry or Little Bomb? Little Bomb, of course. Okay, Little Bomb, watch yeah. <laughs> So, I uh, get to know Little Bomb Bad Edition la uh, game kilo. So, the game do sub guess little kile so that viewers yeah. amni more jani okay. uh, So, first question: Somewhere you would love to perform? Somewhere I'd love to perform Ultra Music Festival, Tokyo, Japan. Acha. Yeah. Uh, where do you draw your inspiration from? Oh, melodies. Melodies. Melodies really inspire me a lot. Okay. Um, what is your favorite thing about your career? The favorite thing about my career, mm -hmm. like uh, still uh, I haven't done that much. Still a long way to go. Mm -hmm. But like uh, looking forward to be like uh, traveling around and doing shows. Acha. So yeah. Which already grace no I mean like it's uh, just. Nearby, so okay. coming up a gig. I have a gig coming up in Pune so okay. next month. So that's yeah. your next big thing. Uh, yep, mm -hmm. exactly. Yeah. Uh, what would you change about yourself if you could? What would I change about myself? Um, I don't think I'll change anything about me because I'm the bomb. Okay. <laughs> 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 uh, would you rather gulp a whole bottle of beer or milk? Of of course, milk. Okay. <laughs> um, number of excess you have had. Number of. Excess you have had. Excess, uh, that I. You can't oh say man. again. I can't even remember. <laughs> <laughs> Please try to remember. We can wait. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> That's like really tough. I, I can't even remember. You know. So. <laughs> okay. So, uh, Abdida, uh, are you single? I'm single. Yeah. Okay. So you're open. Open. <laughs> okay. Something you want to be wanted to become growing up. Besides my hmm. present career, hmm. uh, boxer. Boxer. Yeah, sure. I think I'll be the smallest boxer in the world. Talking or not, music DJ Cheryl. I mean, that was just for like uh, I was really uh, interested in uh, karate and all okay. the stuff. So when I when I was during my school days, mm -hmm. so. So karate classes can be listened on. I took kick, uh, kickboxing. Okay, yeah. wow, cha cha. But like, uh, right now if I'm a fighter, then I don't know. Like, I wouldn't be able to pass 
anyone. Anyone. Okay, talking about your interest outside of music, I'm new. Ita aji kali. Kinga kiki occupy gona rakhi ab niye. Besides music, actually right now I'm on the process of making my music video. Acha. And and also like I'm doing a collaboration with Kekre Ringa. Oh wow. So the song is actually completed. Hmm. It's in the style of uh, it's in the style of very eighties, uh, mm -hmm. so retro, Is retro, it retro? Yep. Mm. new wave retro. Okay, and um, by next month uh, we are going to shoot that uh, MV mm -hmm. as well. Yeah. So uh, other than music, I'm um, yeah. new. Like you said, karate we kushi pay. Yeah, that then was like long back. Yeah, long back. So uh, ita other than music, I'm um, nikiki kuli kushi pay. Uh, like. Besides music, just uh, watching videos, uh, oh. following UFC and stuff. So okay, nothing productive. Uh, besides music, nothing much. Uh, besides <laughs> music, nothing much. Yeah. Okay, okay. Because is then uh, someone uh, you would like to collaborate? Someone I'd love to collaborate, local or international. I think both. I think both. Mm. Both. Um, locally, Nagaland will be my shifu. Or sensei, however, DJ, na. Okay, so abni Japanese kala bishi kushi pai na. Kushi to pai bishi. And international would be, I don't know. There are lots, man. Alan Walker, yeah. Alan Walker. Yep. Oh, chacha, tika si. Do you like she question round game? Well done. Okay. So, mo i do, you know. Every so musicians can give who do manja like the question it does na like man kita nagalen di when it comes to nagalen music to bishi man wa man serious career choice nation we consider no grade na or any obviously talented musicians can bishi zero actually the bishi palo na jai see obviously like music la field do to live you know kita concert live gigs ni live ingan performance can they do like any matuo bishi man wa musicians can like free of course Right, uh, right. Performance do they expect right again? So I'm new in an iku instances can iku in a experience connection and I of course like uh, back then I did a lot of uh, free gigs uh, when I was starting out mm -hmm. back in Kohima. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's the thing that's like one of the mm, biggest problem that artists are facing Achha. right now. Mm -hmm. So which is like uh, one of the reason that I uh, was signed into this uh, Infinity Inc label, mm. so that like uh, I don't have to do any more um, free gigs, mm. or free shows, nothing like that, mm -hmm. because everything uh, is managed by the uh, label. Okay. So yeah, at least uh, right now uh, I'm performing every weekend mm. here and there, and then yeah, at least mm. that's what. <coughs> That's why I am working with the Infinity. Okay. Yeah. Then, uh, no, I mean, DJ Lalap, we do ki DJ for DJing, Nagalendi, do gig kan paole gane ki man hard ase. Okay, so uh, something people have to understand like, there are uh, different types of DJs, okay? okay. Like, uh, regarding the uh, music genre, there are like DJs like me who perform house music, techno, mm -hmm. bounce. And then there are like other DJs who perform uh, commercial music, hip hop, and all those. So like there are like different types of genres. So like, I think it's the marketing that uh, the promoters or the club owners, uh, and then even the DJ himself or herself should mm. do. You know, like the that's how you should promote yourself, mm. so that um, slowly by doing shows in clubs or private parties or even music festivals or where, wherever it is. Mm, you get to play what type of mu music you want, and then and then you get recognized by it. Mm. So, uh, yeah, marketing is uh, very important. Mm. Like, um, and then uh, see, I think this is like for the DJs only. Okay. I think uh, back back in two thousand five. Uh, we all know Tomorrowland. Mm. Tomorrowland started in. <laughs> Tomorrowland is a yeah. music festival, okay. and then it started in 2005. Mm. It was in Belgium, and then when it first began, uh, it, the, there was just a handful of crowd. 
mm. but nowadays like uh, this festival uh, people are from all over the world are traveling just to be in that festival every year and then even the tickets are getting sold out under five minutes only mm. so like if we had a music festival solely for the DJs only even mm. out here in Nagaland mm. then I think uh, that will be like a very good platform for every DJs mm -hmm. the types of DJs mm. out uh, we have out here mm. and I think like um, uh that sports person james kitan brother james kitan he even he said like uh the sports uh, scenario like uh, they're like um needing the help of the government mm. so likewise mm -hmm. even as the djs and producers i mm. think like uh, we definitely need the help of the government i think like the government should like uh, help us to um have like music festivals only for mm -hmm. the edm music mm. scene yeah. Uh, because like currently there is only one big um, festival which is the Hornbill mm. and then a lot of DJs are not getting the opportunity to perform there mm. so yeah okay so these are the changes of the Saom Jai Nagaland now right, right, in terms right, of music industry right, right. Uh, so I mean I do question to my name first of all do like it actually but then I forgot. <laughs> so, <laughs> okay. I mean, without this, yeah. yeah. uh, so your real name is Little Long Cherry. Yep. And then, to do it, man, you should have the Little Bomb. Gonna join. So, I mean, first, we do the Little Bomb. Do name. Could you ask? Okay. Um, when I was starting out as a DJ Little Bomb, uh, people were actually confused with the Lil. You know, the some uh, rappers uh, they use their name as Lil. So, it's actually not a rap name. Okay. It's actually Little. Okay, I just because you're lit. <laughs> yeah, I just sort of shortened. Okay. As uh, okay. Anyways, um, when I was young, everybody used to call me Chutu. Mm -hmm. Like even uh, in the colonies, and then even in the school, and then even after my school, I was like a uh, biker. Okay. With riding with bike gang, uh, biker gangs. So, sure. the the whole like every one of them like wherever I go, people uh, people used to call me Chutu, Chutu, Chutu. So I still, so ca I still carry that name. Okay, were you often dead in them No, no. Sure. Because like I was Chutu only. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, so that is why like I think I still carry that name. A little so person with big personality. <laughs> <laughs> and um, bomb. Okay. Bomb is like... Uh, it... You know, like... Um, it actually came out from my full name. I'm not going to reveal my full name. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, like, <coughs> I heard that uh, the meaning of my name is, um, you know, the starting is Lee. Mm. Lee means in our dialect for us is Lishi, you know, Earth, mm. Earthquake. Yeah, yeah. And then... Mati. The yeah, yeah, Mati. Mm. And then the rest of the name is like uh, something like Shek. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. So basically, earthquake. it's like earthquake. Okay. So earthquake. Uh, come on, why earthquake? So uh, instead of earthquake, I like uh, turned it into bomb. Okay. So yeah. It, so so it's like that. your name, like Amnila Music, like, it makes sense, yeah, because you are a DJ and you are shaking everyone. <laughs> 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 That's why I like give a really deep thought about it. Uh -huh. Like it took me days. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. So you know, uh, when it comes to our Nagaland life, what I go, I'm not here. I'm not like I'm not for the manamba waking up perceive for especially the elder section of the society. Uh, right, good question. Um, <coughs> actually, um, I'll start with my parents. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, mm, from the first place, they didn't uh, want me to do do music. Mm. Um, <coughs> But then, like, I kept on insisting them, and then I uh, tried myself, like, so uh, I, as much as p possible, I tried to uh, keep the consistency. Mm. So, like, my, <coughs> just like I said, my biggest breakthrough was uh, back in 2017. Mm. That's when my mom and dad came to see me perform. Okay. So that was such a lovely thing. And <coughs> from then on, slowly, slowly, I know they are still like, uh, yeah, um, 
why are uh, why are you doing this like sometimes mm -hmm. they are like mm -hmm. uh, but like it's okay like uh, just mom dad don't worry mm -hmm. just believe in me and then at least like nowadays they are supporting which i'm really glad mm -hmm. so that's my you know thing mm -hmm. uh like uh, how do i put this like um my friends were like really supportive of me mm -hmm. some of my uh, cousins were really supportive of me and then like uh, yeah some cousins like especially the elder uh, elder ones like uh, they were like um, <laughs> most of the time calling me up and then like why do you want to do this job why do you want to put this as your career now mm -hmm. um, and then looking looking to the future I don't think this will be right for you I don't think this is good for you mm -hmm. so uh, like they have their mindset like that only but then like according to me see like you know <coughs> in other cities or countries like uh, there are s still like big DJs like 50 60 years old mm -hmm. they are already married they have sons and kids but they are still doing shows traveling around the world doing shows gigs and that whatnot so I think um, thinking that and then looking at them like that's what keeps me going mm -hmm. and then uh, under the guidance of uh, DJ Ina, mm. so I think yeah, I'm getting the best okay. support Good from job. him. Yeah. Then uh, through your performance, uh, what experience is guaranteed for the people? Um, <coughs> you know, uh, I'm like uh, more of a, a house DJ, mm -hmm. the uh, house music genre. So like. Um, uh, for me, like uh, I try to give them um, the best moment so that uh, uh, they they could have the best they can have the best uh, memory mm. about that uh, particular night. Mm -hmm. oh, so yeah, a very I'll give them I uh, I always try to give them a very uh, punchy and a groovy vibe mm -hmm. all the time. So mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Maybe Abdullah show there only Munjo. Oh, definitely. <laughs> invite maybe, me. maybe, maybe not invite, but maybe I'll take you. Oh wow! <laughs> Please. Thank you so much for having the conversation. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much for coming. It was very engaging, and thank you so much for the engaging conversation. Thank, thank you, you so much for having me. Like it was such a pleasure, and I'm deeply honored. I'm deeply humbled. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, today I share a conversation with uh, DJ Lil Bomb, or an interesting conversation. Every morning, stand up with Ambu TV. Thank you.